some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in Miami, Florida, where a band of misfit idiotic frauditors demands to know the name of a clerk, but they end up getting kicked out and leave empty-handed. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Miami-Dade School Police Facility. Here with Rago Monkey. Jay Surreal. Have mass accountability. Yo, yo. Make sure you guys check them out. We're here to retrieve property. Hey, how's it going, guys? How's everything? Fine, you? I'm doing alright. I'm looking for the evidence, lady. Remember, you told me to come on the third? So I'm here to pick up my. Thank you. And I'm here to pick up those records. Remember, I did the records request? It has been processed, sir. Thank you. It has been processed. Give me a moment, please. Hi, what's your name? I'm sorry, just so we know who we spoke with. I can't hear you. Give uh, me a I'm just said, what's your name so we know who we spoke with? I'll be right with you, sir. That's your name? Well, what's with the attitude? I'm, I'm just no, a little lost. Me I just me. asked you your name. That takes right two right seconds. Right. Look, my name's Jay. You saw how fast I was? Quick to anger over nothing. And such a priceless, nasty attitude to boot. I've seen people get kicked out of Walmart for attitudes like that. 20 minutes later. But you told me she's hey, going to be here Sergeant, tomorrow, right? Sorry. She'll be here tomorrow? Sorry. Hey, Sarge. How are you? My first name's Jay, man. I'll be back um, tomorrow. I was, I was asking her her name. Can you write down she didn't want to give me her name. She was like, kind of giving me an attitude. I told her my first name's James Jay. James Darby ID. And, um, you know, I don't understand what's the attitude. You know what I mean? I asked her for her, her name, too. Yeah, yeah. But let me ask you something. You still have it. Oh, here. Um, your first name you're the records clerk, correct? Records request. Okay, I'd like to do a records request. Absolutely. Oh, I'm just going to verbalize it. No, you got the right. No, no, <laughs> no. Under Florida Statute 119, I can verbalize it. I do not this have to write it. This is first rodeo, you know? And, and still, this you haven't given me her name. first name and her first name. This ain't, this ain't my first name. No, I, I am not. You are cool. You gave me, you gave me no, your name. I appreciate that. that. I you really do. I sincerely cool, do. As long as y'all do what y'all supposed to be doing. It's a really right. simple public and record request. You don't even have to write it down. I gave my first name, Darby. I gave my first name, and still, I don't even know who she is, and I don't know who she is. You know, you guys, what's so hard about just giving your first name? You know? I just don't get it. I don't understand it. What is it tonight? Uh, I just, I'm going to do a public record request. You know? uh, I just need your name you and employee ID. Anything. You don't have a job? I have a job. And, uh, so you get paid on mine? Uh, no, I'm a, I, I have a different job. I'm a tattoo artist, yeah. man. I don't have, I don't have, listen, I don't, I don't care to answer oh, you know. There's certain uh, questions that I answer, there's certain questions that I don't my answer. My name and my employee ID. Okay. That's public it's record. A public it record. record. He needs to know what my name and my employee ID is. Yes, that's a public, public record. record. That's and, public and record. Under. Title and your duties. No, he'll get it through the public. Make it. Make a request on them. No, I, I can. You can no, verbalize it. Can. Oh, are you having trouble? Did you misinterpret the law? Maybe it has to be submitted in writing. Perhaps you should go back and take a look. Because statute 119 is rather long and complicated and would take a great deal of eating comprehension skills that I'm sure you sorely lack. Literally, the, so, to provide real, real, real quick, real quick, guys, real quick, let me say something. Hey, let me so, say something. You, no, 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 you're, you're going to listen to me real quick because what you're doing, right, yes, you are, you're a public servant. You, no, 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 you're, you're going to listen to me real quick because what you're doing, right, yes, you are, you're a public servant. You, no, 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 you're, you're going to listen to me real quick because what you're doing, right, yes, you are, you're a public servant, first of all. Secondly, okay. Shh. You right now, you right now are actually guilty of a misdemeanor. So I want you to shut up and just listen to me for a second. I can tell you to shut up. You're a public servant. I have a right to redress my grievances, particularly by the First Amendment. You are delaying a public records request. She can real quick just give me her name and ID. What else you want? You are, you are unlawfully delaying a public records request. You want her public records request, you want a name Florida like Florida statute 119.07, subsection 1. We making it. You can get it in now. You got an email or something that we can send it to? No, right now. Yeah, it's called no, gofuckyourself at gmail.com, and you can right give now. it to me now. We want their name right now. That's all. It's a public records request. It takes two seconds to identify. 
Gee, what a smart mouth you've got. Now I understand why you're not gainfully employed. Why you can't find a job other than being a frauditor on YouTube. I'm lawfully redressing my grievances. Okay. What am I being trespassed for? Right. Let's go. What am I being told to leave for? Finally. What am I being told to leave for? What am I being told to leave for? This one, next time, next this time, you just told me. I have a right. Myself? I have okay. a right to tell you to. Okay, all right. I need you to talk. Why? Why? I didn't say that. So you're going to you're gonna move everybody out of the building? Yes, 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 yes. yes. Cool. I've got your name and ID. Are you going to arrest me if I don't? Yes, come, come, come. Under arrest? Under arrest? Come, come, are you going come, to arrest me if I don't? Sir, can you please? Can you answer that? Are you going to arrest me if sir, I don't? Sir, how, how, do how do you not know that my email address is not gofuckyourself at gmail.com? Okay, but listen, um, all of you guys need to leave Are you going right to arrest me if I don't? My can email address. Can you call us staff for me? Yeah. My email address is gofuckyourself at gmail.com. Here's a little advice from Ned Flanders that you might find useful. Here's a catchphrase you better learn for your adult years. Hey, buddy, got a quarter? That's not disorderly con. I have multiple email addresses. Are you sure about that? I'm going to tell you. No, you haven't done nothing. You haven't done nothing. Can you give me their names? Can I ask them? They're not going to. They're going to unlawfully delay a public records request in violation of Florida Statute 119.071. That's battery. That's battery. That's simple battery. You're touching me. I'm asking you to walk out. You're touching me. You're asking me. It's not a lawful order. Come on. You could have just really simply, she could have just given me her name and ID. She could have given me her name and ID. Resist? Yeah, I can resist. Okay. It's unlawful. Yep. City of Houston v. Hill. So where would you like us to go? Oh, you can't think for yourself, can you? You've lost the script. Now you're all lost. Well, one thing's for sure. You can't stick around here. No, but and, 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 um... Where would you like us to go? You told us just to exit out of the thing. I, I need you to come off the building, please. Sir. Off the building? So we can go over here to the parking lot? So you're ordering us. So there you have it, guys. So you give somebody your email address, and they tell you that it's disorderly conduct. All right, so I left the building. <laughs> If this is what we doing, this is what we gonna be doing. So but see, the thing is, you can easily fulfill. Y'all a group? No, no, no. Y'all a group? Y'all a group? I got a family at home. Are you sure? Darby, I'm on official business. I'm here to pick up property that you told me to come today. No, 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 Don't straighten it up. Where are we supposed to go? Because you told us to leave the building. We've left the building. We've been a thousand feet of this building. Guys, look at this. Thousand feet of this building? You're coming. For my, for me giving you my email address. For me giving you my email address. Me. I told you my email address. You're not making any effort to leave. You know what this next step is? Trespassed. Don't you touch me. You just went to touch me. I'll be back tomorrow, Darby, to pick up my property. And I'll be seeing you with an attorney for violating a public records request. Immediately after this incident, I reached out to an attorney who is reviewing the case. Yeah, good luck with that. Maybe you'll find one that won't charge you thousands of dollars for a retainer.